Hello everybody, I'm finally here to show you my chia seed juice recipe with fruit, so I'm pretty excited. You're going to want a pitcher, so I'm going to open this up, and Dadumi's here helping me today, eating some of the strawberries I'm going to use, and I chose cranberry raspberry juice because that's just the kind I like, and it's good for this recipe. I'm going to take this, open her up. Pour all the juice inside of your pitcher. Try not to make as much of a mess as I am. Now I really love chia seeds and I like it thick like the mama chia juice. So I'm going to add quite a bit in. They give you this little scooper inside of the chia seeds that I purchased. And I just got them from the grocery store. And I'm going to dump an entire cup in here. That looks good. So I'm going to dump it in now. And before I stir it, I'm also going to dump in one quart of cut up strawberries. Make them whichever size you like. I like them like a medium size because I like chewy and crunchy in mine. So I'm going to dump all these in. And I'm also going to add raspberries, half a quart of raspberries. And I forgot to get a spoon to stir it, so I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. So now, I think I'm gonna show you what it looks like, because I think it looks cool. Bear with me here. Whoa. All right, I'm gonna give it a quick stir, and then I'll show you what it looks like again. Make sure you get all the chia seeds nice and wet. And I did not cut up my raspberries because I like them big and chunky, so if you want smaller size raspberries, that's fine. Just go ahead and chop them. It smells really good. Oh, the Doomy wants more strawberries. There's a few left in the bowl. There you go, baby. Okay, so I'm going to show you what it looks like again. This is mixed up. Looks a little weird that way, doesn't it? That's okay. All right, and these are going to take about, I want to say it's going, well, it takes four hours for them to expand and your juice to be ready. It's better if you do if you leave it in the fridge for overnight, but it's not necessary. If you just wait four hours, it'll be great. The fruit will infuse the juice and the chia seeds will be ready. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. I did make another video today trying to make slime. It was a complete fail, so you probably won't want to watch it. But I will be making another video on how to make Turkish coffee soon. So if you want to subscribe, you will see that soon. You have a great day. Bye.